So many times I hear about why am I unable to narrate my PowerPoint presentation and save it as a video file from a Mac? Well, you can narrate your PowerPoint presentation and save it as PowerPoint slides, but you cannot save it as a video from a Mac. Here, I'll show you. So say we're going to go to this slide and then we'll hit insert and then we'll select audio and then we'll select record audio. And we'll call this one slide one and hit the record button. This is a test for slide one and we see it's countdown right here and we'll click insert. And we see that this slide now has audio and we can go ahead and play it to double check it. This is a test for slide one and we see it's counting. Okay, perfect. So say that we did that for all of the slides. And then we, when we go to export it as a video, we'll go to file, export. And from file format, we'll choose MP4 or move. Either will give you a video file. Let's just go ahead and select MP4 because it's the most universal. And then we'll leave the quality at presentation quality, which is 1920 by 1080, perfect HD, and hit export. And now that it's all done exporting, let's go ahead and open it to see if we can hear the audio. We see the audio, we just cannot hear it. So it didn't work. But let me show you a workaround that does work. So I'm going to disclose this here from PowerPoint. And now since I'm on a Mac, I'm going to go ahead and launch Keynote. Once Keynote opens, I'm just going to go to File, Open, and then I'm actually going to open my PowerPoint in Keynote. There it is, example presentation with the PowerPoint extension and click Open. And now our PowerPoint opens up into Keynote. We can see the first audio clip that we recorded in PowerPoint on our Keynote. But let's just go ahead and select it and delete it and start over. Let's start from scratch on the first slide. We'll go to Insert, Record Audio, and then we'll go ahead and introduce our slide and we will record our audio on each slide. And then when we save it as a video file, it will play seamlessly. And here's my test presentation for narrating presentations and saving as video files from a Mac using Keynote as a workaround and stop. Go ahead and insert it. If we didn't like it, we could edit it and do it over, but let's just say that we like it and we'll move on to the next one. We'll go ahead and insert some more audio. And here is a beautiful place, I believe Switzerland, where I think that this is an absolutely breathtaking picture that I wanted to share with you. Stop, we'll go ahead and insert it. Don't need to preview it. And when we play back the video, these audio icons will actually be invisible in the finished video. So let's try again. We'll go and add an audio clip here. And here is a road in the beautiful California Redwoods. And insert. And like Audrey Hepburn says, Paris is always a good idea. Insert. And like the wise words of Leonardo da Vinci, simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. Keep it simple and elegant, folks. And like the wise words of Leonardo So when I go back to each slide, I could see the audio clips and play them back. Slide by slide, we've narrated them. And now we're going to export this as a video file. Go to File, Export to Movie. And from here, under the Movie settings, you want your playback to be self-playing. You want all the slides. And here, make sure that you basically go as low as you can go. 
go to the next slide after one second, maybe even zero seconds, because you don't want there to be any lag time after your narration. As soon as the narration of the audio clip is done, you want it to automatically move to the next slide so there's no silence in between. And for the resolution, you can choose 720 or 1080p, which is HD. I, let's just leave it at 720 for now so it could export fast so I could show you. And click next. For this example, we're going to save it to our desktop. We can get rid of that one because we know that that one did not play and we'll go ahead and open this one. And here's our new narrated Kino slash PowerPoint. And here is my test presentation for narrating presentations and as video files from a Mac using Kino as a workaround. And, here is and we see it goes immediately to the next slide, which is what we're hoping for. Breathtaking picture that I wanted to share with you. And here is a road in the beautiful California redwoods. And like Audrey Hepburn says, Paris is always a good idea. And like the wise words of Leonardo da Vinci, simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. And now that you're done, you can go ahead and close your keynote, save it, and then here's your new narrated presentation in case you want to go back and change anything. But since we have our finished video here, we can upload this to wherever we like. Happy creating, folks.